Hi guys, welcome to my channel All About Food. My name is Saili Habde and today's video is going to be a long and soothing tutorial on how to clean crabs. Primarily, it's important that the crabs you buy from the market are all alive. The ones that I have bought are freshwater crabs and I have purchased a dozen of them. That is 6 male crabs as they are enriched with more meat and 6 female crabs because during the monsoons you will find crab eggs also called as lark in them and the meat is even more tastier than the male crabs. Now to get started with the cleaning, the only tool you will require is an old clean toothbrush. As you can notice, the claws and the legs have been already removed by the local fishermen as it becomes easy to bring the live crabs home. Brush the outer surface of the shell thoroughly with a toothbrush in order to remove the dirt, mud and slimy texture that gets formed on the shell. Do this under running water as it becomes easy and quick to clean them. If you don't clean them thoroughly and you cook the crabs, it may emit a weird taste to the gravy or any dish that you prepare and may also cause stomach infection. Once you have cleaned the surface, remove the hind legs and wash them under running water and keep aside on a clean plate. As you can notice, the male crabs have a triangular plate and the female crabs have a wide and curvy triangular plate. Female crabs have a soft shell whereas male crabs have a hard shell and are a little tricky and difficult to crack open. Similarly, do this process with all the crabs. Also scrub all the crab claws thoroughly with the toothbrush. This is just a close up of how a toothbrush literally scrubs off the dirt from the crab shell. Now, wash all the crab legs thoroughly in water and keep aside on a clean plate. Now that every part of the crab is scrubbed and cleaned, it's time to crack open the shell. To crack open the crab, turn the crab over and slide the bottom triangular plate. Once opened, twist and remove. Now, Place one thumb on the gap formed after removing the plate that is at the bottom and place the other thumb either on the hind leg or keep existing the thumb till you find a comfort spot where you can put the pressure to crack open the shell. Once 
once you crack open the shell twist and remove the mouth of the crab discard it after that remove the feathery cone lining which is basically the lungs of the crab they are indigestible and thus are not advised to consume also they taste terrible again scrub the inner shell with a toothbrush to remove any impurities wash the stomach under running water and do not remove the internal green thing from the crab because some say that the green material is the liver and the orange thing is a lark which is crab eggs mainly called as roe or corals in shellfish found in female crabs earlier i would clean everything from the crab like literally everything that's when my fisherwoman advised not to because that's what you're mainly paying for coming to the top shell of the crab slide your finger under the mouth and remove the tongue it has a bitter taste and thus needs to be discarded double check if there is any hard substance left wash the top shell under running water and maintain the gooey edible thing inside the shell do the same process with all the other crabs Also, while holding the crab stomach under running water, you can notice that nothing is coming off. Rather, it's all intact. You can either wash crabs under running water, or you can crack open the crabs, clean them, and then once all the crabs are internally cleaned, you can wash them with limited water in order to save water. Also it becomes really difficult for me to stand constantly at the sink. I find this method more comfortable.
The bottom plate of the bale crab is little difficult to open with fingers, so use the tip of the knife to open the plate. Now that all the crabs are cracked open, clean the crabs thoroughly with water. Remove the black thread if you find in any of your crabs. This was the only crab that had the black thread like structure. This is how the clean crabs look like. Hope you liked and enjoyed this tutorial. I also hope that I was able to explain everything properly. Do share your feedback.